Hi everybody! In today's video I'm going to reveal to you some interesting facts I found out about wedding rings. So let's start right away with the Chinese explanation about why to wear a ring on your fourth finger. You can try to do it with me if you want to. Put your fingers together like this and unite all the fingertips. The middle finger goes down like this, okay? Alright. The Chinese believe that every finger has a specific meaning. So the middle fingers represent us, that's where two fingers become one. Our thumbs are our mom and dad and you can separate them easily because they are not gonna be around forever. Our index fingers stand for our brothers and sisters and you can separate them easily too because sooner or later they are going to have their own lives. And your pinky fingers are your children and you can separate them easily as well as they are going to have their own lives too one day. And the ring fingers are impossible to separate. Try! You can't, can you? You cannot uh, separate them because this is a person you love and get married to and you are meant to stay together forever. The earliest examples of wedding rings are from ancient Egypt around 5000 years ago and the first rings were braided from hemp or reeds. Do you know why they started to wear a wedding ring on the ring finger of the left hand? Well, basically the ancient Egyptians believed that this finger enclosed a special vein that was connected directly to the heart, the vein of love, or in Latin, the vena moris. And the circle was believed to be a symbol of eternity. And the ring was given to a bride as a symbol of eternal love. For the ancient Romans it was very common to give a bride an iron ring, which is the origin of today's metal wedding bands. Early Roman law recognized three different kinds of marriage, confariatio, usus and coemptio. In case of coemptio the marriage was more like a purchase, and Romans saw a ring as a sign that the ownership of the woman would be passed from her father to her new husband. To the Romans, iron symbolized that marriage was strong and could not be broken. The tradition of both the bride and groom wearing wedding rings only began during the Second World War. Before that, men didn't have a ring to wear on their finger. They started to use it during the Second World War as a key to their memories about the wives and families back home. 